Greetings and salutations! This is Imperator Vespasian and his trusty sidekick. Hello! And we are bringing you an unboxing video on Crypt Ghouls. Mm. And they're from Gamesy Workshop. And what do Gamesy Workshop have to say about Crypt Ghouls? Um, <clears throat> when the lean and hungry times of famine came upon the old world, the inbred hamlets of Sylvania Took, a, took to feasting on corpses. These cannibals were dri uh, driven and ma uh, driven mad by the meat of the dead, and over the years degenerated into a race that is no longer human. Driven by an unspeakable craving for human flesh, they dwell near graveyards, digging up the corpses of the recently buried and consuming the cold flesh. That's disgusting. The ghouls are stopped, are stooped, stooped, um, and disgusting creatures. Their skin is blotched and filthy. Their eyes beastal, is that beastal? Bestial? 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 Bestial. And their snarling lips reveal rows of sharpened teeth. When the armies of undeath, un, un not undead, gather, ghouls scuttle from their hiding place to join them. Vampires and necromancers and their masters and ghouls fear their wrath upon any other command. Yeah. So they're scared into fighting then? Yes. So it's basically exactly the same as Lovecraft. Yeah. Um, that Where was got the idea from? brought to you from the original edition of Vampire Counts. Um, we're not playing original edition of Vampire Counts. We are playing Cthulhu. Cthulhu. Yes. Um, so we'll have a look at the... If I can open it without damaging it. No, I've already damaged it. I've damaged it already. How dare you? I've damaged it. I've damaged it. I've damaged it. So, right. I'm going to order a vote in no confidence in your leadership. I, that's not very fair. <laughs> so these are the ghouls themselves. They're pretty cool. Let's have a look at them. Um, if you look, I remember this guy. Um, he's actually dragging a skeleton. Because he's eating it. That's awesome. That's so ghoul-like. Ghouls are just wicked. Did I just use the term wicked? Yeah, you I, just just said, you I did just that, said didn't that, I? Yeah. I actually said mm -hmm. that. You're down with the kids. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, fellow kids, innit? Yeah. Um, so, they're the feet of the ghouls. They're really scruffy and dirty. I like the flesh hooks that they're carrying. Very handy to just there, the flesh hook, um, which is uh, you hang meat with it. Um, it's very handy for, you know, if a ghoul is in a graveyard or on a battlefield, they can just hook the dead body and drag it away. Sometimes the body might scream because it's not actually dead yet, <laughs> but the ghouls don't tend to care. They don't mind warm flesh. So that's the, you got all sorts of bones and stuff in the hands. That is pretty wicked. I said wicked again. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll stop, I'm going to start speaking now. Do you want to speak? No, nah, I'm alright. No, I've okay. enough. Okay. Um, we've got... The heads, let's have a look at the heads. These are the torsos, which are very spiky. And we've got the heads. Look at those heads. Don't say it. They're awesome. Yeah, good. <laughs> got you. There's a nice open skull there of some poor guy who the ghouls got hold of. Oh, there's a, there appears to be a ghoul that's uh, just there. If I can get him in focus. Who is throwing up? That's, that's good. So what's the family that the ghouls mainly come from in, 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 in the Americas? Delaport? I don't know. Oh no, there's and they're one of the French families I who originally settled. Well, we've come across them in our campaign, mm -hmm. but they're not ghouls yet. Um, yeah. Pick Pickman's part of the same family, yeah, he's descended from them. So it's, it, 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 Pickman's part of that line. Um, so there, there, that, that's pretty good. Um, if you want to see the ghouls in action, um, that's the ghouls in action, uh, fighting against the Indi troops from uh, the 35th Indiana. Or Pikmin, Pikmin's model uh, art. Oh yeah, search Pikmin's model as art basically and, and you'll get it. Um, Put it this way, you don't want to go to a train line ever again. <laughs> <laughs> yes, there was a terrible disaster. Um, the, the train disaster, which is in this book, let's just... Uh, um, there's a it was a, it was a famous disaster in American history where it was I think it's called a subway accident. Um, 
You don't really need to find it in the book, anyone knows. You know what happened? The train crashed and the ghouls um, came out and ate all the people who... Yeah, it was bad. Yeah. Yeah, lots of people didn't make it. Um, so, oh, and that's the inlay book. That's quite good. Um, the... Oh, the New York subway disaster um, in 1899. Um... Uh, engineers building a busy subway between New York, between uh, uh, beneath New York uh, had begun to encroach on the Ghoul City Warren, uh, prompting irregular attacks by the creatures. Uh, they lost more and more their territory to the roaring trains. By 1816, uh, by 1916, uh, the Ghouls had massacred at least one railroad passenger car uh, in a t uh, tunnel near the Battery and the 120th Street. Uh, the NYPD. Um, organised a subway... P can I say that anymore? Is that, is yeah, that, that's is fast, that banned? Fast. Can I say that? The NYPD um, organised a subway detail to patrol the lower tunnels and drive the ghouls back. It's a very famous thing that happened in American history. Um, it, was, it, was, it was really good. Bad. Bad. Not good. It wasn't bad good. It was Pikmin, bad. Mate. Yeah, Pikmin. I am actually playing Pikmin in the <laughs> <Yeah>. campaigns. <laughs> Not that Pikmin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. His great 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 grandfather. We're all playing the great 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 grandparents of the people in. in yeah, it. mine has the one of the worst plot lines ever. Yours, yours gets He's eaten. Completely useless. <laughs> he has no powers or mystical powers whatsoever, and his his great 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 grandson dies by a shag off in like the first few minutes. He gets eaten alive. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That that's uh, that's your character. That's that's your. Great. I'm so happy. Yeah. Well, you picked him. <laughs> Um, anyway, these figures, um, we, we can use them for all our Lovecraft stuff, um, but these particular figures that they were working on, I'll just adjust it so you can see them better. Um, these these figures um, we, we're going to be using for both the earlier campaign that we're playing, the, the campaign set in the mid-1600s, uh, to a campaign set in the mid-1800s, which is something that happened in America in the mid-1800s, some sort of argument some people in blue and some people in grey fought each other <laughs> i don't know what it was about um but um there's a chap called uh, colonel albert delapore of the virginia cavalry um he um used ghouls as an offensive weapon so he he would um encourage the ghouls to attack the union forces and there was an incident at um chapel farm Ch chapel farm chapel is it chapel farm what's he called i'll look it up Hang on. Chapel's Farm, yeah. Uh, an incident at Chapel's Farm, which is where the um, Irish Brigade were attacked by ghouls, and they were uh, Company B was nearly wiped out, which is an interesting thing. We're working towards that in the campaign at the moment, aren't we? Yes. Yeah. Although all our characters are English. No, only two of them. Two of them. Oh right, only two. Oh yeah, these two are French. Yeah, yeah. forgot about that. <sighs> I speak my own language. And you can't even speak English. Your yeah. language skills are absolutely yeah. atrocious. Um, I can speak French now. You can um, speak French, yeah. yes. Um, I can intimidate you. Just spam it. <laughs> and you, 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 you walk around with a um, pike. Yep. You're a pikeman, yep. aren't you? Yeah, yep. I have. Which is awful when you try and walk into doors because you have to get I this 18 foot pike through the door. Lot. I have a massive amount of uh, Kafumi Foss and occult. So he's very, very weird man. Yeah, you're doing quite well on it, really. And you fail to go insane. I, I go insane all the time. It's really <laughs> it makes sense though, doesn't it? It does. I am, I am descended from Pigment. Um, yeah, I, my character goes insane continuously. Um, so he spends most of the campaign, like five to ten turns, hiding in a corner screaming because the rats are trying to get me or something. And I have an intense phobia of something. Mm -hmm. Rats, actually. Now I do, yeah. Now I do, yeah. Thanks to the incident that happened <laughs> in the last game. Um, so, yeah, anyway. Oh, wow, well, I'm the one that got bit on the shoulder by one. <laughs> you did. A, a rat tried to eat you, didn't it? <laughs> um, so these are the... And then I forgot that there was a well here, so I walked straight through the well, didn't I? Yeah, <laughs> you did. Everyone else did. <laughs> oh, you walked through a door and fell down a well because there was the door went into the well. I saw the everyone else. And, and then we all followed you and we all fell down. <laughs> And and we're injured and and then we managed to make our way out, so that's it. We, it all ended happily. And one of them we kept, kept screaming for like nine turns. Yes, we went insane. Yes, we went insane. And um, the the lady in our game, 
Um, sorry, the lady. We have two two girls in our game, but the, but the lady, the woman who's playing the lady, um, she uh, we've discovered that her house is actually on the top of a warren. So, which is fun. Which is fun, and she's scared of werewolves. <laughs> right. So that's it. That's the end of the video. I think we've waffled on enough. <laughs> well. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe and comment down below what you think of the crit ghouls. Oh, and don't forget the, the bell button because it's very important. That's everything from me. And everything from him. Goodbye. See ya.